thing that makes those words, and uh, we use that frequently on this show. Let's have a look at those scores. Lawrence, 11 points. Tony, 37 points. As we head into our last games of the week on this Friday night. And, uh, Tony, the last letter's choice, please. Then we all start with the consonant again. Thanks, Tony. S. And another consonant. T. Uh, one more. N. And I'll have a vowel, please. E. And another vowel. U. And one more, please. A. And I'll have a, a consonant, please. R. And another consonant. L. And one more consonant. And last letter, R. And here's the clock. letter selection of the night. Tony, how did you go? I'll stick with a safe seven. A safe seven. And uh, what about you, Lawrence? Uh, I think it's a safe six. Okay, let's have that first, please. Sultan. Sultan. And uh, yours, Tony? Neutral. Neutral. Those both sound good, David. Now, I understand uh, Tony's comment. The safe seven is neutral and the risky, which is fine, and the risky eight is neutrals, which is not risky because neutral is a noun, meaning someone who is impartial. So that was the eight to be found. Nice work, David, and uh, well done to Tony. Seven points. Final equations for the week coming up, and uh, Lawrence, please choose the numbers. I'll try to redeem myself somewhat. Uh, can I have four smalls and two large, please, Lily? Thanks, Lawrence. That's two large and four small. And last set of numbers for the week. One, ten, two, seven. The two large, 150. And the target number is 646. Thank you, Lily. Let's see if we can get there. did you get? 6.46. 6.46, yep. spot on. Well done. Tony? I was one away. You were one away. Okay, Lawrence, take us through your method, please. Okay. <laughs> Seven times 100. Seven by 100. 700. 700. Minus 50. Minus 50. 650. 650. And then subtract 10 divided by 2. Take away 10 divided by 2, which is 5. Plus 1. Oh, sorry, yep, which is yep. 645. 645. Plus the 1. Add the 1. 646. Very nice work indeed. Right to the target, Lawrence. Spot on. And uh, Lily, did you do it the same way? Yeah, good method. A great approach and 10 points for Lawrence. So our scores now, Lawrence is on 21, Tony is on 44. Well, here we are. It's the final game of the week. And it is, of course, the conundrum where both contestants have 30 seconds to discover the scrambled nine-letter word. So... Let's reveal tonight's conundrum, and your time starts now. What do you think it is, Lawrence? Maybe causation? I'm afraid that's not correct, so I'm going to restart the clock, and Tony, you have up to the remaining time. from Tony, so let's have a look at our conundrum solution for tonight. And it is... Tenacious. 
So that means that with the scores, Lawrence on 21, Tony on 44, our final round winner tonight is Tony. But Lawrence, well done and uh, well played. There was some fun tonight, so thank you very much for joining us. And of course, a Macquarie Dictionary for you as well. Thank you, Richard. And Tony, well, well played. Once again, uh, you've held the carryover champion seat. Uh, a very strong game again tonight, and we look forward to seeing you next week after the weekend. Look forward to it, Richard. Well, it's been a great week, David. Uh, did you have a, a word from the week? Actually, a word that we had earlier in the week, and it was abacus, uh, which has a beautiful story attached to it. It comes from the Hebrew word abak which means dust, because originally it was a board covered with dust that was used for writing and calculating in. Fantastic background. Thank you very much. Well, enjoy the weekend. You see too. you next week. Now, Lily, I want to see if we can make a deal here, because we, you know, we were checking our checklists at the beginning of the show. I'm prepared to go wallet, keys, handkerchief, phone, and add that to mine. Are you prepared to go wallet, keys, phone, handkerchief? Gross. No way. No! <laughs> no, I, th I think I'll stick to the tissues, thanks, Richard. <laughs> I'll see you next week. Thank you for playing along with us uh, this week. Have a great weekend, of course, and we will see you with more brain-testing treats at 6 o'clock on Monday night. Until then, good night. Yeah.